what is good pisces welcome back to my channel pisces let's get right into your reading all right so pisces this week we have the seven of wands the world card and the three of what is it swords in reverse here so i'm hearing not to even give it a second thought pisces so we have the death and rebirth at the bottom so i'm feeling like what whatever you're moving away from whether this be heartbreak from a relationship or a, I don't know because I don't even know if it's like I feel like there's an indifference type of energy here when it comes to something I think right now you're stable with what you're doing you're moving forward in the best way that you know how and the world is opening up for you I feel like you're not giving something a second thought or any emotions when it comes to something you're just allowing the process to play out this could be about something yeah with the tower card and I saw the four of um wands pick up so this is excuse me <laughs> so this is about um you really moving forward you're allowing the process to happen so this is like true alchemy here i'm getting like sitting back relaxing letting things happen and letting th but the only thing through here is that this is why I'm, I'm getting like that indifferent energy because you're stable within pisces you're not allowing what's happening on the outside to shake you up here this week which is really really good here so we got king of wands energy and the king of pentacles energy so what i see with this is you have the right amount of passion behind something but also the right amount of discipline and stability so you could be doing something this week that is really like sticking to a schedule or really like trying something new like even, let's say you didn't have discipline before this happened or whatever you're taking whatever happened and alchemizing the situation so say you got your heart broke you're doing something now that is helping you to gain more emotional stability and more discipline in moving forward on like let's say getting your body like the way that you want to get in your dream body or getting like making more money or whatever this is so this is you really putting in energy that from that heartbreak to that and you're not uh, not caring about what comes crumbling down around that your only focus right now is yourself here you have the two of wands you moving through this new path here i'm hearing something about you're walking through the door and you're not giving it a second thought here don't give this person a second thought you're not giving yet because you're over the situation and you know what i'm hearing it's been over for a while so you're just giving yourself that permission to allow this this to unfold in any way that it needs to here yeah the death and rebirth came out again yeah so this is right over the three of swords in reverse and the um king of pentacles so you get more stable within and also that comes in form of more finances for you is what i'm hearing the more that you tune into yourself this week pisces the more exactly with the six of pentacles you could be receiving a check in the mail or you could be seeing receiving a huge refund from overpaying on something or some unexpected money is coming in because you're taking a look at yourself you're freeing yourself you're not placing expectations on how you get your healing done so sometimes like when we get our healing done we want to have those that emotion to like really just relax and cry and do all the things and the why this why that i don't feel like you're asking any of those questions pisces you're like you know what this didn't work out or that didn't work out or I, i'm not doing this or i'm not doing that it's cool what do i have control over right now that's what i'm going to put all my focus in on is the things that i i have a lot of control over yeah so with the three of cups in reverse this could be you leaving a certain friend group as well or like being okay with relationships ending or like not having support in whatever it is that you're doing so this could be that too as well i feel like you're just relying on your your intuition yeah five of pentacles so this could be something that you've lost like a job or lost friends or lost something here i feel like you're definitely being more in tune with your star player which is you internally but also to like whatever you have faith in you're really moving towards that this um you're moving towards that this week and i feel like with the knight of wands it's definitely going to give you something to definitely look forward to and then we had the full card fall out i didn't see that but yeah this new beginning so you have a new desire to move forward and you're putting forth that energy into that into this new beginning i feel like there's tons of like new beginnings that we have like every week you guys are from every angle because i'm getting something about it's always a new start or you're feeling like you always have to start over everybody starts over multiple times in their life and some people every day 
because every moment to me is new so i like to move in my life that every day is a new beginning and if i don't think about what happened yesterday it does not exist so i feel like this is the same energy that you have going on pisces it's like if i ain't thinking about it and giving it no attention then did that really happen no like it doesn't exist because all that we have is now so i feel like you're getting a sense of understanding you could definitely be meditating more the seven of pentacles you really are taking that time to seven of wands excuse me you're taking that time to really see what you want to put the effort into in your life and what's worth putting effort into and what's not so it's like you're at this point where you're like look this moment is new to me yeah with the ace of pentacles putting down something new like you're like look every moment is new for me this is what i'm choosing to focus on right now this is the where i'm going to be in my life so say you're not an athlete and you all all of a sudden decide you want to be an athlete like okay like well you wake up the next day and you're like well i'm an athlete now so what do athletes do okay so they get their diet in check they get this in check you're really like seeing how you can make yourself better at the same time while progressing past this heartbreak yeah so it's like getting rid of all the negative things or like the thoughts that you've had like in your head or the thoughts that this person has said for some of you something about like body positivity or like i don't know why i'm being drawn to working out a lot but i'm getting something about maybe this person or maybe these friends or maybe you were hanging around people that you didn't feel like you could be yourself with or like i don't know something here about like not being accepted so yeah, with the Ten of Wands, like, yeah, you put that baggage down that you don't have to answer or, or have to be appealing to anyone else, um, Pisces. This is something about, like, you accepting yourself for how you are, but still within that, if there's something that you don't like, you, you know you want to work on those things, you're like, you know what, like, what's the plan for that? Like, you're not really giving it a second thought. You're just like, look, I don't like this, or this is something I would like to change. Like, like let's not give it a second thought. Let's do it. So yeah, with the two of cups here, I feel like you're making, this is me, this is what I'm feeling like you're making friends with your ego here is what I'm getting, or you're making nice with like a part of yourself that is overly dramatic. So it's like you're meeting, cause I don't know why I'm getting like you and then like the angel on one shoulder and the devil on one shoulder, kind of like getting you to be overly emotional or getting you to be very angry. It's like you are the one, your higher self, your intuition is like, look, this is what we're doing and like how can i utilize both of this energy how can we play together into making our dreams come true so this is really like alchemizing this situation yeah with the eight of cups walking on to something greater here putting that hard work Ooh, with the listen listen you're gonna know what to say how to say it and when to say it but also to hear it with the eight of pentacles and the high priestess your intuition is telling you what deserves your attention what deserves for you to put that work in on so i feel like this is like you really like coming into union with yourself and realizing yeah with the magician card come through i know i know you pisces as a fellow water sign i know you so i feel like when all the pisces that i know when they get in this this type of stage in their life master manifestors master manifestors you know what you're doing you know how to call things into existence you know how to use that emotion but also you know how to use like that stability within to, to manifest whatever it is that you want with the two of pentacles yes balancing out that hard work and play but also your intuition you're utilizing it you're doing a dance with it you're not you're not dismissing one side of yourself pisces that's what i like about this energy this week yeah with the queen of pentacles listen and you just know that you're abundant you know that you're it without all that extra stuff so i feel like you realize who you really are this week pisces through not trying to get validation from anybody else yeah with the five of um wands here so getting away from that mindset of competition or needing to be do and have something in order to be accepted by others yeah so when these people try to come back because i feel like they will in the future here with the knight of cups in reverse like saying oh you look so good or oh this or oh that like really trying to give you your flowers here there's people that will come into your life pisces who will give you flowers without you having to work for it they just give you flowers based off of who you are and your personality so something about you'll know the difference here so let's see yeah listen to your higher self pisces listen to yourself listen to that inner world that you have and listen and the sun card is on the oops, sun card is on the bottom of the deck here so listen everything that you want is right here 
on the other side of you learning how to trust yourself learning how to really be okay without being validated and walking in that knowing that you are the shit regardless all right pisces all right i love you pisces thank you so much for being here and i will see you guys on my next reading bye